How's it going guys? Good early morning. Um, this this place is really, really interesting. Um, so I'm at an abandoned nursing home. Um, it was built in 1927 and uh, it ran as a nursing home for I think majority of those years. I think it was used as something else potentially. Um, but when Hurricane Katrina hit, it really damaged this place and it's basically been sitting ever since 2005 ever since the hurricane hit um, left abandoned and pretty pretty sad state uh, right now but some of the ar architecture around the outside I saw was pretty amazing so we'll check out the inside and I'll show you some of the outside as well and uh, let's go check it out the elevator is uh, underwater <laughs> Got a really, really old fountain that would have been awesome back when this place was up and running. Now it's uh, just been graffitied and the vines are growing on it. As you can tell, these uh, archways and the columns and the fountain, like this place was really nice when it was up and running. Uh, whoever built it back in 1927, they really, it went all out. It's uh, it is sad. It really is sad that this this place just got just destroyed, and uh, that's that's part of the re that's part of what happens when uh, 
when an abandoned place, if it's right in, you know, in a, in a big area with lots of people around and they don't secure it, um, vandals just come in and destroy a whole bunch of stuff. And uh, it's sad because this place, I mean, it's beautiful, but it would have been a lot more beautiful without all this destruction. Um, albeit uh, the hurricane didn't help any of the matter. So this is the second courtyard. There's two there's two courtyards. There's one here and then there's one on the other side of this chapel. So this place this place is huge. It's two story, uh, very, very big. It doesn't look that big on the on the outside, but on the inside it's pretty big. Yeah, unfortunately, a lot of this building is such, so vandalized after the hurricane. It just, uh, it's kind of a shell of its former self. I don't know what all this stuff is. There's like boxes and boxes of stuff. Oh, it looks like the like drop ceiling. Looks like the stuff for a drop ceiling. Got a nice kind of second floor balcony that wraps around some of the courtyard.
Um, I apologize that some of this is kind of dark. I thought I charged my light and I guess I didn't. <laughs> I'm gonna head out of here guys. Um, this place, there was so much just beautiful architecture and the chapel was just amazing. Uh, unfortunately, all the inside kind of rooms and hallways and stuff were just damaged beyond belief, graffitied, vandalized, destroyed a lot by the hurricane. Besides the architecture um, of the building and some of the columns and, and the chapel and stuff, I guess there wasn't too much necessarily to see, but Hopefully still enjoyed because it was just a beautiful building. I mean, it was built nearly a hundred years ago and it's still standing uh, despite all the, the damage. So anyway, I'll talk to you guys soon. Uh, stay tuned for more abandoned stuff coming up. And uh, if you like these stuff, if you like these videos, subscribe, hit the bell button. That way you get notified of every video I put out. And uh, besides that, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you soon. Take care, guys.